going on guys it's hitler i'm just kidding it's blurry here guys bring you another video today and i don't know if you can tell something different in my quality in my mic but i fixed it i didn't realize that the settings on my mic on like the razor mic you can do what the fuck am i saying on the mic on the back there's a knob you can twist and there's like four different fucking settings for the mic. I mean, I knew that, but I had no clue what they did. And I finally went through the other day and we're testing them. And I, yeah, I realized that it really does make a difference. Holy shit. Like, I don't know why I didn't. I don't know why I didn't do this a long time ago. Like, bruh, my quality sounded like shit. I mean, it wasn't terrible. It was, it was pretty bad. I, I don't know. If I got a pop filter, it'll still sound better than I really should. Or I'll just take like a fucking sock, my jerk off sock, and I'll put it around my, uh, my mic. Just to, as a pop filter for now until I get one. Anyways, it's fucking finally spring break. Finally. Oh my gosh. A lot of people were probably already on spring break before us, but thank god it's finally spring break. Two weeks off. Oh boy. Fucking great. This is literally my first game on. I feel like I'm just shitting on people. Like, my fucking accuracy seems like it's on point. I don't know what this is. What the fuck I'm taking right now, but goddamn. Before, I actually used to play competitive. I think I started in, a little bit in Ghost. I did a little bit in Ghost. Started doing, like, random clan wars or twos with friends and stuff like that but then when aw came out i actually really started getting into gbs and umg and if you've never like played competitive and you think you're like really fucking good on multiplayer and you go to play competitive it is honestly a completely different fucking feel of the game like it's almost a whole different side of the game it's really i don't know how to explain it if you've never played competitive but it, it's pretty crazy people constantly sweat everybody knows exactly what they're doing so like you can't just Go expecting to play it and thinking you're just gonna shit on everybody. It's completely different playing a pub. Pubs, you just go in, literally any match, and you start shitting on everybody. I always ended up getting teams, though. Two of the players or something like that on my team wouldn't even be that good. They hardly would call out or anything like that. I'd have to end up backpacking them, and it was really fucking annoying. I was kind of wanting to take it serious. Possibly end up even getting decently out there from playing competitive. There's times where I wish I still did play competitive. I always think. I always get shit players, so there's really no point this guy is hg 40 lucky motherfucker god damn and the hotline bling let's take a look at that virgin that just you know spends money on fucking cop and the high five himself good job dude with your single no friends virgin asks you are good job dude round of applause oh supply drop watch let's get complete fucking aids from this thing that moment you open a rare and get one rare in two commons fuck off i don't know just like i think it'd be cool to play competitive it's a nice change in playing call of duty when you just play normal pubs then go into competitive so it's a complete change in the game like actually beating people in gbs or thing like you get such a good feeling i don't know why is you get that huge competitive feeling like if you're losing you get so fucking heated especially if you're relying on teammates that aren't doing shit you get so like oh my god you're literally just sitting okay anyways fuck that kid anyways guys i hope you enjoyed the video if you did drop a like and subscribe if you have not yeah it's been blurry guys peace out